How long can a jury deliberate? Hi, come on in. I'm Jerry Oginski, a New York medical malpractice and personal injury trial attorney practicing law here in the state of New York. I just got back from court and this question came up because my client asked me, Jerry, how long can the jury deliberate? The short answer is it can be as long as they want. The longer answer is it could be as long as they want. Now I'm sorry to give you the same answer for the same exact question, but here's the reality. A jury has to go back and decide who's responsible for what happened to you. And once they do that, if they find in your favor that the other person or people are responsible for your injuries, now they have to go ahead and answer the next series of questions, which is, which are, what injuries did you suffer and how much to compensate you as a result of your injuries? And there are multiple questions that the jury has to answer. They may reach an agreement. It may take them a short period of time to do that. It may take them a bit longer. There are juries who have been out only a few minutes and came back with an answer. Juries can be out for hours. They can be out for a day or more. And you hear all the time on the news involving criminal cases that juries are sequestered. Well, in New York, in civil cases, juries are not sequestered. It means that they're not locked in a hotel room and they can't get access to TV and news and the computer. In a civil case, jurors go home at the end of the day. And again, it depends what time they go out. If they go out in the late afternoon, it's quite possible they won't get to a decision by the end of the day. They'll have to come back and keep deliberating and until they've reached a decision. And here's something else you should know. In New York, you don't have to have a unanimous six-person jury for each and every question that's being asked. And that's something called the five-sixth rule. You only need five out of six people to answer any one question. So my clients ask me all the time, well, do you need the same five people? to answer each question? The answer is no. It does not have to be the same five people. As long as you have five people to answer a particular question, that gives you the answer to that particular question. So what kind of questions can you ask? Well, I'm going to address that in another video. If you found this information helpful, what I want you to do is to press that button below. If you're watching this on Facebook or YouTube, it says like. If you're watching this on Google+, press the share button or the plus one button. And if you have legal questions, pick up the phone and call me. I can answer your legal questions. This is what I do every day. You can reach me at 516-487-8207 or by email at lawmed10 at yahoo.com. I'm Jerry Ojinski here in New York. Thanks so much for watching.